Hey, what's up everybody? Rod J back again and tonight I'm taking a look at one from Odell Bruin out of Fort Collins, Colorado. This is the St. Lupulin Extra Pale Ale. Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to check out another video. So this one comes in at 6.5% ABV. It is a seasonal from the brewer, Odell Brewing Company. Here you can see the look of the can and on the back side, a little information. It basically talks about this one being dedicated to the resin inside the hop. It is a seasonal offer, so this is not available all year round. Looking forward to seeing what this one has to offer. Another one that I picked up when I was traveling in Dallas at one of the uh, Total Wine and Moors, and uh, we don't get a lot of Odell brewing out here, so when you see it, you gotta get it. Some good stuff about them. So far, I've been pleased in all the beers I've been trying from them. Hopefully, this one holds up as well. This one also carried a nice date on the can, so the time of shooting this, I'm actually two months out from the uh, Best Buy date. Get that all into the glass there, get that turned around. So this one comes in with uh, a slight chill haze, but a good amount of clarity. You can see me through the uh, golden yellow color there to the other side. Came out with about one and a half, one and three quarter finger uh, foam which has a little bit of foaminess, not as much as the uh, recent uh, fresh grind ale that I had done for them, but a good decent amount that it could still lace the glass nicely. Not picking up as much of the carbonation bottle, uh, bubbles as you can see as I sit it there. Not seeing too much of that action actually happening as far as the aroma. You do get a nice uh, bit of a resiny quality in the beer. That little bit of a dankness as people will call. Not as much on the notes from tropical or citrus like you have with say some of the India Pales. This one is definitely more of a pioneer type feel. A little bit more of an earthier note. Even a little bit more of like a floral in the aroma as far as the taste. First of all, that, first of all, that goes down rather easily. It's got a nice crisp cleanliness to the beer. A little bit of the scratchiness in the throat from the hops. Nice drying effect to it. You can feel it really nicely in the cheek area as well. Flavors are lingering nicely. This is actually really nice. A um, little bit of that resiny dankness quality. You do get some of that in the taste as well. But you think about some of the ones that are being put out by some of the other breweries nowadays where it's almost overly done on some and some you have more of a heavy feel. This one doesn't have that. It has a nice feel to it, but it's not overly. It's just enough to kind of let you know it's there, which is actually kind of nice. Very pleasant. Can really just sit back on this one. I can see why it's a summer seasonal. If you got a chance to pick this one up, I'm going to just say you want to pick this one up. Um, if you're an extra pale ale fan because this one is actually really decent for them the more I'm drinking it the more I'm actually liking it there you have a little bit of that lace there on the glass as well get a little bit of that uh, floral and pine in the taste coming through but a very nice put together beer there's really not too much more I really need to say about this one it's just got a nice crisp overall body of work to it very decent very uh refreshing carbonation is not heavy you don't see any of the bubbles but it's not flat either it's just really put together in a nice kind of way one that i would say to definitely pick up if you see it out there out west or i don't know how far east they may go but again the saint lupulin extra pale ale odell Bruin. and again this is a brewery i've heard a lot of good things about so i was looking forward to trying a lot of their beers and was able to get a good handful this one for me is actually a very pleasurable, pleasant type beer. I'm going to give this one a uh, 425 out of 5. Sits with me very nicely. It's got a nice, almost classic extra pale ale feel to it that sometimes you end up missing because of everybody else trying to do so many different things to the beer nowadays. Uh, nice, nice job there with that uh, Odell Bruin. Thanks for swinging by to check out another video. Look forward to catching you next time. Keep drinking those good craft beers. Remember, there's always time. Get your beer on. Cheers.